Nine is three more than what? So what's the first thing I look for? Is, right? Okay, so I look for is. Is nine, right? Or nine is. Is represents equal. Nine, I just write it here. Okay, nine is equals to whatever. Then the next thing I look for is three more. Three more means, what did we say? Plus three, okay, plus three. So of course you know that a number, uh, uh, addition, an addition sentence must have something plus something equals to answer, right? So this one is answer is equal to something plus three. Okay, so I know that I have a something here, a blank here, which corresponds with this. Okay, which corresponds with this. Okay, so ta-da! I have my number sentence. Okay, now this number sentence looks odd to some of you, right? Like, like me. It looks odd to me. Why? I mentioned it in the last lesson. Not the last segment, but the last lesson. I mentioned that I don't like to see the total here, here because I'm not comfortable with it. So I can change, okay? I can swap it and say something plus three equals to nine. It's the same thing. Nine is here, something plus three is here, and both are equal, okay? So it is okay to have it like this, something plus three equals to nine. After you look at this and you find, eh, I don't like it, you can always swap it, okay? So what plus three equals to nine? Here, we did it in the last segment. Nine is the total made out of three, two smaller numbers, three and what? Correct? So that's number bond. Nine is made out of three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's six. Three and six make nine. Okay, so 9 is 3 more than 6. Notice how I talked about friends, like a family. This is a family, alright? This is a family. So, these three numbers will be together depending on how you rephrase it. Okay? So, we're going to practice these three questions. You do the same thing, alright? 17 is 5 more than what? So, are you able to do it? For me, what I'll do is, I'll take out my highlighter and start highlighting. Right? I know that 17 is, 15 is, 13 is. Tells me equals to something. Okay? Right? Equals to 17, equals to 15, equals to 13. Right? Then I have more than... 5 more, 8 more, 7 more. So I'll have 5 more is plus 5. 8 more is plus 8. 7 more is plus 7. Right? And then after that, I look at this blank, this blank, and this blank. It will be this blank, and this blank, and this blank. What did I just do? I translated the language Okay, this which is very complicated to this which is a number sentence. Okay, then after that I work at it. The way I work at it would be the similar to this, right? To get this answer 6, I said that I took 9 minus 3, right? So here is the same thing. I can take the big number 17 minus 5. Okay, so 17 minus 5. How do I do this? I make 10, okay? See, there's lots of practices that you can, you can do. If you deliberately work on it, all right, you can do it like this, or you can do it this way. I'm going to show it to you, right? 17 minus 5. You can break 17 into 7 and 10 and use the 10 to take away the 5. Or you could take... 10 and 7, and use the 7 to take away the 5, right? So, if I were to do this, 10 minus 5 is very easy, so it's 5. Then I take 7 plus 5, I might need to count a little bit, 7 plus 5, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, I might have to count a little bit, so I get 12. Now, if you do it the other way, you take 7, 7 minus 5, quite easy. Most of you will be able to tell this 2. 
10 plus 2 is quite easy also. 10 plus 2, you know, is 12. Okay, so it's up to you whether you want to do 7 and 10 or 10 and 7. It's really up to you. Whichever you're most comfortable with. Okay, after all, the answer is still 12. So 17 is 5 more than 12. Okay, now 15 is equal to what plus 8? You might want to try this method to see if it works for you. It's good to practice. So we know that it is 15 minus 8. Okay, how should I do it? Should I, should I do 5 and 10? Because I said, okay, you will think that, oh, but I said that, you, you said that I could change, right, interswap. So could I do it this way or should I do it 5 and 10? Well, if you want to do it this way, 5, can you minus 8? You can't, okay? Because you can't, then you will have to, you have no choice but to do this. Okay, so 10 minus 8 gives you 2 and this is a 5. You add them up, you get 7. 15 is 8 more than 7. Okay? 13? 13 is equal to what plus 7? Can you, do you know it mentally? 13 minus 7. What will you put here? What number will you put here? Will you put 3 or will you put 10? I will put 10. And this is 3. Okay, 10 minus 7 gives me 3. 3 plus 3 gives me 6. So 13 is 7 more than 6.